Hello, today I'd like to present Unger's DI-140 deionization system. The system is made up of two cartridges of 4.5 liter mixed bed resin, and that's good for 1,400 1, liters of water with a 180 ppm. This system takes out the minerals from the water to guarantee a streak-free uh, window cleaning process. When this system is shipped, you will find attached to the system a bag with your input valve, a roll of Teflon tape, and your output valve that goes to your water-fed pole. You will also find the user manual and your key that allows you to unscrew the resin cartridges. This input valve goes on this side of the machine where you can see in. And the output connection goes on this side of the machine where you can see out. Now we're going to get the system ready for use. As you can see here, we've attached the valve, the input valve to the system, making sure that we wrapped it first, the thread first with Teflon tape so that this is sealed. And that is done on both sides, also with the output connector. We're going to take our hose from the tap, make sure that it's connected, take our hose running to our water fed pole, connect that, and slowly turn the water on. And this is going to fill the first container full. As the system runs and both containers fill up, you'll notice these two red buttons up here. This is the air ventilation point. What you want to do to make sure that there's no air in the system is press both of these buttons until a little bit of water comes out and therefore you know there's no air. Once that's done, turn on your TDS meter up at the top and it shows that there's zero ppm coming out of the pure water side. Now when you're working in the field, if you notice that your TDS meter is showing you 20 ppm or higher, that means that your filter needs to be changed. The way you're going to do that is first turn off the valve coming from your input, take the hose off, take your hose running to your water fed pole off. <clears throat> And now you want to make sure that the system is still without pressure. So you're going to press on your pressure points, make sure that there's no air in there. Grab your key, loosen up the canister. Twist it off and be careful because the canister is full of water. Empty out the water into a bucket. Take out your resin filter. And now you have two options. You can either order a completely new filter from Unger or you can take off this this uh, rubber cap unscrew the top be careful there is a sponge on top and then empty out the resin 
Now once you've replaced the resin in here, you're going to take the sponge, place it back on top, and then clean around the threading so that there's no extra resin on the threads. Take your cap, screw it back on, put the rubber back on top, and if you notice, the bottom here looks like a fan, and then the top has your rubber seal. Place that back in the canister. and screw the canister back onto your system. Lastly, take your key and tighten the canister back onto your system. Now it's changed and ready to go.